Right, hello and welcome back to Backpack Hero. So, let's uh, start a game here. Looks like they've changed the menu a bit, so let's start a game with tutorial and then start a game now, I guess. So, just changed up the menu a bit, I guess. Oh, they're finally... Ah, so there's a new character. He's the son of a noble bird on the run from the evil crow king, Corvus. With his bag ripped and torn... Uh, and town captured, sorry. With his bag ripped and town captured, Satchel seeks the help of other heroes and to discover the mystery of the spiral of feathers. <coughs> well, I guess we'll try out a new character then. And I'm thinking we'll try pauper mode. Because I want to try the. <coughs> I'm wanting to try the penny pinch mode, really, where instead of. Uh, items you get uh, a store at the end of each combat and a bunch of money <laughs> that sounds interesting so we're gonna do that we're gonna try to unlock that by beating pauper mode so we'll try that with a new character oh Ooh, this is an We've got a flute. Adds five charm to an enemy. And that, and we've got a feather shiv. Can be used one time each turn. For each feather in another, for each feather shiv in another pocket, this item gets plus two damage. Okay. Seems interesting. Let's go to the bramble. <clears throat> so it looks like he's going to be a charming character of some description. Flute. And flute. And stab. And more flute. What does charm do then? If an enemy has more charm than health, they will fight for the player. Ah! <laughs> yes! You work for me now! Nyah, 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 nyah! <laughs> Well, the enemies still attack me, and I'm nearly dead. <laughs> brilliant, brilliant work. Right, let's try that. Okay, so he's now going to run away. Right. Not great. Satchel's backpack is torn. When he levels up, he can add new spaces into his bag. They do not need to be adjacent <coughs> uh, to other spaces. You can create disconnected shapes. Each section of blocks is called a pocket. If the blocks are adjacent, they are part of the same pocket. If they are not touching, they are part of different pockets. You can have many pockets in your backpack. Ooh. <coughs> Then let's add... Oh, we choose one of these. Okay. Um, let's go with that then. That looks fairly good. Right. Can put our flute at the top. And we can take... Ooh, a chipped, sh a chipped sword might be good. I guess we'll just take that then. Um, sure. Oh, and it looks like now the combat rooms actually block vision through the rest of the dungeon. 
Ooh. Interesting. And we're probably dead. Yep, we're dead. <laughs> Well, that was short-lived. Has it given me more room this time? No, I think it's given me the same, just organised differently. Hmm. Strange. Well, it's definitely a unique character, I can give it that much. Right. Ooh, a chest. A horn. Adds four charm to all enemies. And a climbing glove. Okay. We can make this sort of work. Right, let's hurt this one. And charm this one. Okay. Looks good. Let's get him. And then when they're charmed, they just run away. Ah, but that, the problem is then you won't get the experience for them, will you? Yeah, that could be an issue. That works quite well. Let's go with that. Guitar can be used one time each turn for free, uh, and it adds three charm to an enemy. Just gonna be a travelling band, aren't we, at the end of this? One man travelling band. <laughs> the slat shield might be alright. I don't really see much value in adding charm to all enemies. I mean, if I guess if you're against two or three people, it could be helpful. Shield might be better though. But we'll be fine though for now. We'll just take that. Right. Okay, we're getting there. <clears throat> and they will now run away. Weird. Oh, we get XP if he... Ah... So it's like you've killed them if they uh, run away. Ah, interesting. Okay, let's rearrange this a bit. For each feather in another pocket, you get plus two damage. <coughs> and 
climbing glove right. Let's put it here. Okay, so we're wearing double gloves. <laughs> Oh, we've got claw hammer. Hammers two spaces away get plus 50% bonus damage. Hmm. That'll do. Let's try to get the hermit crab on the side here. Oh, he's attacking back. And XP, XP. Lovely. I mean, that would fit brilliantly. <coughs> so we'll put it up here. And then we can put this in a different pocket. Right. This goes there, does it? Yeah, right, so it needs there to be another pocket on this. Okay, weird. Obo. Adds 9 charm to an enemy, but gets plus 1 to the energy cost for this turn. Okay. We'll take a shiv. You know, I bet if I put... Let's see, spaces it gives plus one armor, spaces now give... Right, so that gives us some extra armor, because there's a pocket over here. Uh, but it's got space. The oboe. Oh, I see. Oh, actually, it fits. Okay, that fits. Good enough. Right. Let's see what we can do about these crabs. So, knowing that we do get XP when we just charm all of them, Let's add 9 charm there, get the classic guitar going, a uh, horn, and it doesn't matter about block then. Right, let's try how much energy we've got, a uh, fair bit still. Right, and we can end the turn. <coughs> Playing the pacifist with it. Hey, that's a point. I bet if you got a ring of pacifism or whatever with this character, it would actually work. Right, let's see what we can do with this guy. Right, 
Right, we don't have to get much on him now. There we are. Let's put this there. Oh, what's this? Stacking star. Creates a shuriken in this space. Deals 3 damage. This item is destroyed. Okay. Um. Right. Let's put our gloves here. So they're in their own little pocket, so if I get the bonuses. We can put the shiv there as well. And we might as well just keep collecting a, well, yeah, collection of shivs. Right, we can put a helmet in here. Magic star bag. Create shurikens in empty diagonal spaces. Plus one to the mana cost this turn. Okay, so we've got a magical shuriken making bag. <clears throat> I've just realised I've got no gold whatsoever out of all of this. Have I forgot to be grabbing it up here or something? Let's see, so shuriken fire star. Climbing glove left. I wouldn't mind the left climbing glove and a knight shield. That wouldn't be too bad. Uh, we don't need a cleaver. Something to collect here. Oh, money's up here now. It's not. Oh, it's not in your backpack anymore. Ah, interesting. So we might have enough money to, uh, to get that. Feels weird it not being in the backpack. The forge. Many items can be upgraded. The forge costs money, but, but you can use it multiple times. Ah, we can use it multiple times now. Each forge has different upgrades, be sure to check. You can see how many upgrades an item can receive on its card. If it can be upgraded, there will be a number in the bottom right next to an anvil symbol. Ah. So this can have one upgrade. This can have two upgrades. That's new. That's very new. We've got 19 gold. Um, add two charm to an instrument if we get 20. Did we keep one of those keys? We didn't. Oh well. Do we want to buy anything? They could be good just to add HP. So that'd be six, that'd be six, and that would be twelve.
not overly fussed over the horn. I've most been carrying it so that I could sell it actually, to be fair. Um, would I even have room for all of this? I've got three spaces, so I could have I could have the night shield and the glove, <coughs> but not the bandages. But I would like the bandages. Just that slow, steady heal. Right, that'll improve that. There. Perfect. Ish. <laughs> I would take that, but... Yeah, we don't have the space. But I could get rid of the shiv, I guess. Quite common, so I can trade a ship. Right. Oh, did I check out what this was? Oh, yeah, it's the rat. Right, away we go. That was a long first floor. Okay. One fighting for me. <clears throat> this curse will hurt. stars. Ooh, I wouldn't mind grabbing some of these healing items just so I could uh, eat them up right now. I wish you could just use them in that menu so you didn't have to take them with you. Oh, he's a thief. Okay, we're getting you straight away. He's going to run away. Oh no you don't. I'm getting the XP for you before you go. Right. Um. Let's go with that. Gotcha. Not much 
good there. Let's take a bit of a heal. Ah, crap, the thieves gonna nick all my money. I mean, I've not got much, so there's that at least. Yeah, the thief literally just robs you and runs away. Get. And that should be that. <coughs> Get all the XP. Lovely, lovely. Lucky star. Uh, electric wand. Wooden blade. Can't carry anything. Toad's hammer. Can be used one time each turn. Hammer's two space, so we'll get plus 50% bonus damage. It's an uncommon. Well, that was kind of a waste. Oh well. Right, so he's a healer. Right, and this guy's definitely on my side now. And he's gonna heal him for me. <laughs> Interesting. could bring you both around to my way of thinking about things. <laughs> right, so that will end up being connected. Difficult to not be connected now. Hmm. I guess just pop that there then. Right.
Well, there we go. We've got some more armor. Lovely. Right. We've got healers, a locked door, or we can go. Don't think I can even afford anything here. I mean, I could I could afford curse removal, which I don't need right now. Right, boss, it is. Will give me twenty XP. Got a load of dodge, has he? Luckily, I just massively upgraded my blocking capabilities, so ha! Right. Try that. That. We're getting there. We're getting there. And there we go. Right. Each turn adds three mana to the connected mana network. So that's just three infinite mana basically that we'll get each turn. Relic really, on death, so this will basically bring us back on death. All shields will gain the effect of all adjacent weapons I used. Ooh. Now that's interesting. I need somewhere to put it, so we're probably going to lose that shiv. Or I can get a frog totem and just power up this magic star bag forever. Which I've still not used. Hmm. I suppose it depends how committed I am to uh, these ninja stars which I've not used yet or do I want to try the shield hmm. I'm gonna go with this because that could be quite that could get nuts that I think right we need to be organized Right. We get a chest of rubbish and we'll make our way out. Okay, looks like we've got a combat straight away. 
and he's going to attempt to curse us. The brilliant thing with this is while it does like blunt them, it does just slowly blunt your weapons. But it means that you can be defensive and offensive at the same time. Note that we have like 30 odd block now, it's quite ridiculous. Right. quite good stuff here. Right, I'm just going to pause for a moment, you'll probably not, not notice, but I'm just going to pause and look to the toilet. Okay, and I'm back, right, so not that you'll really notice the difference. Um, okay, uh, connecting this up to our bag could be useful, but again, it's finding, finding a spot for it. could we get? Poison, slow, regen on a ring, charm on an instrument could be quite good. We don't have any rings at the moment, but regen would have been nice. Um, now, anyway, I've, uh, uh, as I went out then for my break, I mean, not, not only have I got, uh, gone and nipped it around that like I said but I also just walked past my uh, 3D printer on the way of course the things went out of filament uh, midway through, a, through the job <laughs> uh, we'll try with that so I'll probably have to get that changed soon enough the thing is you can't really tell that they're low on filament until they're kind of get to the point where they're low on like they're really low because if you've ever seen one you know it's this big spool of uh, filament this plastic that goes in this wire uh, wire filament and because it's all kind of wrapped around itself you can't really tell until you can see the center bit which you can't until it's really close to the end so I've set it off with a decent bit of filament tin, thinking, all right, it'll get this printed, and yeah, it, it must have been doing it for about 20 minutes and just run out. <laughs> right. Let's... This isn't really going to be worth using until we've got other weapons attached to it, I think. Not bad. Oh. Talon boots. He 
You see, I'd love to get these in the next combat. So each pocket that has a space above this, get plus three. Ah, each pocket that has a space. Ah. So I'd have to put them at the bottom and they'd have to be like multiple pockets above. Right, that's not going to be happening, is it now? No. No, it is not. So that's not as good as I thought. Right. Vision of danger. Badger boy. Okay. Okay, um, just keep hammering away. Probably one more turn will do it. Now it has got some block up. There we are. Personally, hmm, it's too bad this isn't like a square there and then three down this way. If it were the other way around, like just mirrored, could have put it there perfectly, attaching to the shield. But oh well. Um, I guess this will do then. Now, let's see, okay, what are you, this item floats, on use adds two regen, two haste and one energy, this item is destroyed. that there. Create shurikens and empty diagonal spaces. Right. Bag of shurikens. When combat ends, create a shuriken. Well, let's try this shuriken bag out for once. So we'll add some energy and throw our cup at him, which he'll dodge. And then we'll use our shuriken bag. Ah, so yeah, the one use, three cost, well, zero cost items, right, okay, I get it. So if we could funnel this with mana, yeah, it could really be nice, that, hmm.
Right. It'll work for us now. Nasty. Uh. Okay, let's get this one. Push her open then. Right. He's going to summon more. Wonderful. take the mana thing just to connect up to this but I've not really got much space around this anyway right the wheel moves forward until stopped when this finishes moving turns clockwise when this moves adjacent weapons get plus five damage this turn. Yeah. Triangle. Each turn, when active, adds three charm to all enemies. On use, this turn this item is activated. Not that impressed with the stuff here. Mind you, it is the paupers run, so it'll only be common and uncommon items, won't it? Right. Let's see if we can make it up to here. <laughs> right. Let's get one of these vampires on the side then. opening. <laughs> like nearly half his health gone. Lucky star adds luck. End off hitting the enemy. No. Uh oh. It's not good. Well, let's not blunt these anymore for the moment. Eh? It's that poison that's going to do me. Got to watch out for that. Um, 
That should be enough, right? Yep. Okay. Good job, me. Ooh, piggy bank for money each turn. Oh, saxophone. Can only be used once, but adds 15 charm to an enemy. Ooh. Bank's pretty good. Oh, this is one time each combat. Oh, not each turn. Ah, I see, I see. I think that's fine. Right. That'll have to do. Sable. Okay. Crossbowman. Air defender and then the robber. Oh, for God's sake. He's going to be annoying, isn't he? Get charmed, you git. There we go. Oh, and he's got defender, hasn't he? So he'll take hits for me. Ah, great stuff. Good to know. <clears throat> no! You killed my friend! Who's also your friend? Weirdly enough. Right. Let's get this going. Closing in on him. And there we go. Ooh. There's some good stuff here, but again, we're just absolutely laden down with crap. <laughs> Haven't got the space. We just can get a load of stakes. Um, right. Let's see if we can spend our money on anything. Ooh, we could have added some energy. If we had the money. 
Um, spikes to a shield, slow to a weapon, conductive to armor. Well, clothing. Um, none of them particularly amazing. We'll head on out. We'll see how we fare against the boss. Right. Bubba. Loot. Stab. Stab. It's probably best if we don't start using the shield too early. Ah, he summons, doesn't he? We could absolutely use that to our advantage. <laughs> right. This will hurt for a while. Ooh, yeah. Let's hope we just don't take too much damage early on here. Okay, that charm is building up. So I absolutely have to block this turn. Just barely enough block. Right, let's see how we fare. Right, um... I think I will need to do a bit of blocking. Yeah, yeah, they've gone for me, haven't they? Um, we'll give that one more go. But I don't think there's a great way of us getting out of that, to be fair. I think no matter what we do, we're probably screwed there. Right, we'll not use the saxophone though. Come on.
50. Get one of the chips on, maybe. Oh, not quite. A shivel, new though. Put some block up. Okay, now I'm probably gonna die. Right, we've just about made it. Is that enough block? Probably not, nope. Ah. I think maybe. Because I definitely did make Amis play in one of the turns there. But I think it's still going to be dodgy getting through it. But we'll give it one last go. Right. Okay. Good start. Just keep hammering away. Now, put him with that. And again, put some block up. Now I shouldn't get hurt anywhere near as much. And then start going on a charm offensive. Right, and now I've got that little bit of extra health left. Okay. Right, he's on my side. I do need to block, actually. Yeah. Right. Charm him back over. Give him the shanking of his life. I'm definitely going to need some... Uh, I'm going to need 50 block. Jesus Christ. Okay, this is where I died last. <laughs> mm. But this time I've got that little bit extra health, which has got me to, it's got me through it, so. Eh, <laughs> only deals four now. I'm better off using the flute on him. Stop just summoning guys. Ah. I 
and I have to block. No way out of it. We were dead. We were dead on that one no matter what. Right. Thank you very much for watching. We'll give it another go next time. And I'll see you then for more Backpack Heroes.